Dear students, welcome to the problem solving session, part 4 on inverse Laplace transform. In the first video of inverse Laplace transform, we learned the basics and simple problems. From the part 2 video, we started doing problems on partial fraction. It can be classified into three types, that is linear factor, repeated factors and non-factorizable terms and for all the three cases very important thing is degree of denominator should be always greater than degree of numerator then only i can apply partial fractions in the part 2 video we did two problems on linear factor that is l inverse of 1 by s plus 2 and s plus 3 similarly L inverse of 1 divided by S into S plus 1 into S plus 2. Then, in the part 3 video, we solved three problems on repeated factors. Here we use shifting theorem at the end of the problem to get the solutions along with the partial fractions. In today's session, we are going to deal with problems on non-factorizable terms. Let us go into the session. Find the L inverse of 1 by S plus 1, S square plus 4. Now we have to check the denominator power. S into S square is S cube. So denominator degree is 3. Numerator does not have S. It is going to be 0. And don't think always numerator will be constant. Numerator may be a variable of S. Those videos are going to come in applications of Laplace transform solving in ODE. Wait for those videos. Now let us write capital F of S is 1 by S plus 1 into S square plus 4. Now I can simplify this as A by S plus 1. Since this term contains S square plus 4, I can rewrite this as B S plus C divided by S square plus 4. Now taking LCM, denominator will get cancelled. 1 is equal to A into S square plus 4 plus B S plus c into s plus 1. Now, I want to find some value of s such that I can get the constant a, b, c easily. If I put s equal to minus 1, then this term will disappear. I will get a. Now, I don't have any other number specifically to make some terms 0. In this situation, we have to compare the coefficient of s square, s or constants. Let us do this. First, put s equal to minus 1. Then, this term will become 0. a into minus 1 whole square plus 4 is equal to 1. So, minus 1 whole square is 1. 1 plus 4, 5. 5a equal to 1. Then, a equal to 1 by 5. Done. Next, I am going to compare the coefficients of s square. So here the coefficient of s square is a, b s into s will give the b s square. So coefficient of s square in this term is a and in this term is b and right hand side we don't have any s square coefficient. We have to think like 0 s square. So we get a plus b equal to 0, b equal to minus a. So we get b equal to minus 1 by 5. Next, I want to find c. For this, I can go in two ways. I can substitute a random number or I can compare the coefficients of s or constant which is remaining, which is suitable. Now, first, I will go by taking a random number. I will put s equal to 0. So, this term gets 0. So, a into 4 plus c into 1 is equal to 1. So, 4a plus c equal to 1. Therefore, c is equal to 1 minus 4a. We know the value of a is 1 by 5. 1 minus 4 into 1 by 5. Now, taking LCM, we get c is equal to 1 by 5. You can see the typed version. And it is not necessary always we put some constant. I can compare the coefficient. Hope you understand. Now we found all the three constants a, b, c. It's time to substitute. a is 1 by 5. So 1 by 5 into 1 by s plus 1. b and c I am substituting as minus 1 by 5 and plus 1 by 5. Now I want to split the terms. Otherwise I cannot apply inverse Laplace transform. I will split this as minus 1 by 5 s by s square plus 4. The third term 1 by 5 1 by s square plus 4. Now we have to apply inverse on both sides. We know the formula 
L inverse of 1 by S plus 1 is e power minus t minus 1 by 5 S by S square plus 4. 4 is 2 square. So we get cos 2t. But here to make sign either I have to multiply and divide by 2 or you can simply remember the formula L inverse of 1 by S square plus A square is sin A t by a. So, whatever you do, it is going to be the correct one. So, plus 1 by here a square a is 2. So, 1 by 5 into 2 sin 2t that is e power minus t by 5 minus cos 2t by 5 plus sin 2t by 10. Hope you understand students. Next, we do one more problem 1 by s into s square plus 4. Here we can see degree of denominator is 3, degree of numerator is 0. Then we can proceed with partial fraction. As usual, we write 1 by s into s square plus 4 as a by s plus b s plus c divided by s square plus 4. Now, taking LCM, denominator will get cancelled. We have a into s square plus 4 plus b s plus c into s. Now, I want to choose some s value. See here, if I put s equal to 0, this term will become 0. I can get a. So, substituting s equal to 0, we get a into 0 plus 4. Second term is 0 is equal to 1. Directly, we get a equal to 1 by 4. Next, we don't have any other terms. So, in this situation, we have to compare the coefficients of s square or constant or s. I am comparing the coefficient of s. Now, in this term, there is no s. Here, c into s will become cs. But here, bs into s will become bs square. So, we have the coefficient of s is c. Right hand side, we don't have any s coefficient. So, it is going to be c equal to 0. Next, I am going to compare the coefficient of s square. a into s square. So, we have a. Here, b s into s, we have b s square, so the coefficient is b. Right hand side, we don't have s square term, so the coefficient is 0. Therefore, b equal to minus a and we can say b equal to minus 1 by 4. Now, substituting a, b, c in the problem, we get 1 by 4 into 1 by s minus 1 by 4 s by s square plus 4. Taking L inverse on both sides, we can get the answer 1 by 4. L inverse of 1 by s is 1 minus 1 by 4. L inverse of s by s square plus 4 is cos 2t because 4 I can write it as 2 square. This is my solution students. Hope now you get confident how to do problems on non-factorizable terms. With all this idea, the next topic is very interesting. We are going to solve problems on applications of Laplace transform in solving ODE second order with constant coefficients. Thanks for watching. Hope you found this video helpful. Subscribe to our channel and share it to your friends. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.